This did not have to be the worst case scenario. It was bad, but this breach in the levy, which is an unconscionable thing, and I talked to the governor about this yesterday. We'll get to that in a couple of seconds. But uh, uh, she and her husband both very upset. The Coast Guard had promised, I, I'm sorry, the, the Corps of Engineers had promised the city that they were bringing in these massive helicopters to drop these large sandbags. When I talked to those experts that Sal and I did yesterday at LSU, the water at one time in the day had evened out. And that was an ideal time, an opportune time, to go ahead and drop those. Mayor Nagin is upset they didn't. We don't know why they didn't, but they did not. And uh, <laughs> if we can go ahead and roll the interview with the governor, we'll, we'll, we'll uh, get her comments and thoughts on that. Thanks for joining us. First of all, a, a lot of people do want to commend you for the job you've done on this, especially being down in New Orleans on Saturday and Sunday for the news conferences. And you really have been a very calming voice and, and, and a voice that's brought a lot of people together on this. Having said that, with this breach in, in, in New Orleans we have on this levee, we're about to face real disaster in the, in, in, in the city. Well, it's, it's just absolutely necessary that the Corps get more sandbags in, into that breach. I mean, we've got to stop it some way, somehow. And I'm, I have to get back to the Office of Emergency Preparedness to figure out what's taking so long, why, uh, why the the hesitation, why the wait, uh, what are the problems? There may be, there, there may be problems that, that, um, that I haven't been told about yet, so we have to get that done. We have to stop that water. I, I was told from the governor's office that there are 12 Army helicopters that are supposed to be coming this way. They're waiting for a signature of the Pentagon to get that done. Some of those will be rescue helicopters. Others will be uh, able to, to carry some uh, very heavy uh, um, uh, sandbags, things like that.